This is a strange and complicated High Court decision, which is often quoted but seldom understood. It arose from the enrolment of a student named Vivian Tang in a PhD program offered by Griffith University. The case was conducted on the basis that while she was a student in the PhD program, there was actually no legal relationship between Ms Tang and the university. So, for instance, it wasn't suggested that there was a contract between them. She was simply attending the university by the university's consent and working on her research with the intention of ultimately submitting it to obtain a PhD. She didn't get that far, however. It was alleged that at some point Ms Tang began to falsify her laboratory records. She wasn't doing so in order to alter the records and make them more favourable, but rather simply to save time. The university went through a process, including an appeals process, and decided to terminate her candidacy. Ms Tang sought judicial review of that decision on the basis that the decision was a decision of an administrative character made, proposed to be made, or required to be made under an enactment, the relevant enactment being the Griffith University Act 1998. In fact, though, the relevant power was a power granted under the Higher Education General Provisions Act 1993, that is, the power to award degrees at the level of bachelor, master or doctor. The fact that Ms Tang was there and working on her degree was consistent with the purpose of the university, but the university's statutory powers would not be engaged until she actually submitted her thesis for assessment. Justices Gummo, Callanan and Hayden said, The determination of whether a decision is made under an enactment involves two criteria. First, the decision must be expressly or impliedly required or authorised by the enactment. And secondly, the decision must itself confer, alter or otherwise affect legal rights or obligations. And in that sense, the decision must derive from the enactment. A decision will only be made under an enactment if both these criteria are met. Because there was no formal relationship between Ms Tang and the university, the decision to end Ms Tang's candidacy did not affect any legal rights or obligations which either party had at that time. As a result, there was no administrative decision to review. Mm -hmm.